as you may know in the last couple of days there has been a huge earthquake in Turkey and also in Syria ranging between 7.6 and 7.8 magnitude and there have been lots of aftershocks dams have been in the news in a way that this is a serious condition and lots of cracks critical conditions and even some dams some smaller dams have collapsed let's investigate here's the first one and you can see the reporter actually standing in this earth made dam with a humongous crack he's standing in it On this next video you will see a reporter on top of a dam and you can see this huge crack along the top of the actual dam. It is so wide, this is not just a surface crack, it is so wide you can even fit a stone, a big stone over it to show you. This is only going to get worse and some emergency operations need to be done to deal with it before this dam collapses as well. If you ever experienced a earthquake you know exactly what is is happening because you've experienced this so the roads in this area because of the magnitude of 7.8 that's a huge earthquake basically has cracked roads and making the infrastructure of that area of the world inaccessible and reports of some smaller dams that have actually collapsed, flooding some of the lowlands of the area, again, of the world related to this. Again, this is in Turkey and also in Syria, but you can see here some of the aftermath of the flood after the smaller dams have actually collapsed. What I'm trying to do here is getting all the information on different sources and compiling them all together in one show. Thank you so much for your time. I'll be back a little bit later on with more news, whether it's about earthquakes, whether it's about dams, China, or some of the more exciting life in Thailand. Be happy, be safe, be well, and again, as I have mentioned before, do spend a little bit of time thinking of the poor people who are dealing with this crisis at the moment. God bless to all. Thank you.